In this video, I'm going to tell you how to get access to Sora 2, some quick tips to get better results, why you should use it very actively as soon as possible, and tips on growing a following. Obviously, Sora 2 is brand new, and because it's new, it's wide open, meaning now's the time to amass a huge following. Imagine creating a TikTok account five years ago and providing great content once a day. You'd have millions of followers by now. However, before we go any further, let's get this out of the way. The Sora algorithm is terrible right now. As I scroll through, I'm seeing 50 variations of the same bad content created by people who don't know how to prompt. If I see another cameo of Jake Paul, Sam Altman, or Bob Ross, I may lose it. Fortunately, when you're scrolling, every now and then you get a follow these people, and you can follow people who actually provide good content. Some good news. The Sora algorithm can only get better. The more important good news. If you're one of the people to actually create good content, you can grow your following because you'll stand out. I'll provide some tips on how to get better results with your prompting in a bit. How to get followers. This is a social platform. Follow other creators, comment on other videos, like videos that are actually good. Unfortunately, those are rare right now. This seems obvious, but also add a face to your profile photo. If your profile is blank, people will think your account is just another newbie who's not serious. Very few people comment, so any comment will be noticed by the creator. Ideally, they'll follow you back if you're nice. Currently, there isn't a ratio of the number of people you follow versus the number of people who follow you. So I don't think there's a penalty for following too many people yet. Let's get into some key tips for better Sora 2 videos. Currently, you only get 30 video generations per day. No surprise here, but detailed prompts get better results than short prompts. However, a video generation prompt in Sora can only be 1500 characters long. These next tips are a combination of what OpenAI has provided on their own website and what I've done to see more success. As a quick aside, I always have new tricks that I'm testing across my businesses, and I can easily drop those tips into an email to share with folks. So you guessed it, I'm sending out an email for people who are interested in my latest prompts, workflow automations, or business tools that I've been using successfully. It'll also be covering broader marketing and business operational tips for things like cold outreach, SEO, social media, email management, meeting notes, paid ad campaigns, and a whole bunch more. Candidly, there's a lot of hidden gems out there, and I'm happy to share the ones I've been collecting over the years. So if you're interested, sign up via the link in the description, and I'll see you there. This will sound like a lot, but don't worry. I'll share a super easy approach after I talk through the details. Number one, start with style and aesthetic. This sets the whole tone. Are we talking 1970s film grade, a glossy sci-fi world, or a 16 millimeter documentary? The look has to come first. Next, define your camera direction and framing. Be specific. Instead of saying cinematic shot, say wide establishing shot, low angle, shallow depth of field, soft rim light. This helps the model understand the emotional feel of the camera. Third, keep the action simple and clear. One subject, one camera move, one beat. Describe it in steps or counts, like the actor takes four steps to the window, pauses, and pulls the curtain in the final second. Lighting and color also make a huge difference, so describe them precisely. Mention the quality of light, soft, hard, diffused, and call out color anchors like amber, cream, or teal. If there's dialogue or sound, include it briefly in its own section. Natural lines or small sound cues like distant traffic hiss. For more cinematic control, you can go ultra detailed. Talk about the lens type, filtration, lighting direction, even the time of day. Just keep it under the 1500 character limit. The goal is clarity and intent. The more you direct like a filmmaker with specific visuals, timing, and tone, the more consistent and cinematic your results will be. I know all that sounds like a lot, but don't worry, I got you. I've created a custom GPT that includes all these details that you can use to automatically create better prompts for you. To access the custom GPT, simply follow the link in the video description. Lastly, I've got a bunch of codes that I can share to give you access to Sora. If I just put the codes in the description, they'll be gone immediately. However, if you follow my channel and send an email to me via the address below, I'll send you a code directly, as long as I still have them available. There's no gatekeeping. Please be patient with me though. I do run several companies, I have a family, and occasionally I try to sleep. If I run out of codes, I'll tell you in the video description. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.